Hey guys, are you ready for some spicy magic? Today I have another review for Mr. Clark Olson and his company Mago Hot Sauce. And this is his brand new limited edition ginger and lemongrass hot sauce. Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore back again with another hot sauce review. Now this is the brand new limited edition hot sauce from Mr. Clark Olson of Mago Hot Sauce located in Laguna Beach, California. Now make sure you check out some of my other reviews that I've done for Clark. Uh, he's got some award winning um, hot sauces that are really, really great and they're highly recommended. So make sure you check out some of my other reviews but let's go ahead and get into this one guys this is his limited edition ginger and lemongrass hot sauce all right spicy magic now mago means wizard or magician in spanish now all of his hot sauces don't use any preservatives they're all natural gluten-free and vegan and as he says on his website 100 percent addicting all right, now I just love ginger, I love lemongrass, I love that combination in a hot sauce. Um, I love to see what different hot sauce makers do with that combination. Uh, some are different than others, but uh, let's go ahead and get into this. Here's what it says on the side. Small batch number 001. Here's your spicy spring fling. Our newest handcrafted creation explodes with high energy and the freshest ingredients available. It's a lively experience overflowing with zesty personality that makes you feel wild and leaves you craving more. It's like a Thailand adventure. All right. Deliciously addicting with soups, stir fry, grilled chicken, fish tacos, seafood, and your favorite curry. Thank you for being part of our first exclusive batch of this recipe. And he's got this in rated medium heat, as you can see right down there at the end. All right, let's get into these ingredients, guys. The sodium is very low, only 35 milligrams. But we start off with water, apple cider vinegar, peppers. Now, it's a combination of both jalapenos and serranos. Onion, carrots, garlic, ginger, agave nectar, lemongrass, sea salt, mustard seed, turmeric, and spices so i like that addition in here of the mustard it's going to make it something a little bit different i love the consistency on this one i love the color a nice kind of a mustardy color to it uh, consistency is not super thick and it is not vinegary thin either so it's a nice smooth pourable hot sauce but i just love that bright color to it all right probably that turmeric is giving it some nice gold and yellow kind of color Okay, now the aroma on this one, uh, you definitely kind of immediately pick up a little bit of that tang and tartness from the apple cider vinegar. I get a little bit of the ginger aroma, the garlic, onions aroma. It kind of starts off a little bit savory, kind of bright and savory. Uh, I think uh, the ginger and the lemongrass with their bright kind of floral, uh, peppery um, aromas are kind of in the middle. So it's not like they just uh, blast in the face of ginger and lemongrass. More of what I'm getting is kind of that nice vinegar tartness, but some savory notes from the onions, the peppers, of course, and the onions and the garlic and the carrots. And then kind of in the middle, you get some aroma of the ginger and the lemongrass and then kind of finishes with a nice um, slight mustard vibe. It does not smell like yellow mustard or anything like that it's just you can just kind of recognize in it, that in there just a little bit but it's got a really nice aroma to it all right here's what it looks like on the pour all right here we go with a spoonful of ginger lemongrass mm. now oh this is really delicious guys I think the flavor comes across just like I described it. You get the peppers up front. You get the savory notes from the garlic and the onions uh, and the carrots. I love that about it. Then kind of in the middle, then you get that ginger lemongrass brightness kind of sandwiched in between in the middle. And then it kind of finishes with that nice slight mustard, turmeric and spice vibe. Just very, very nicely done. All blended together really, really well. 
Um, this is super delicious, guys. Now, here's what I did with this one, guys. I thought this would be so good on a shrimp um, noodle stir fry with some vegetables, and that's what I made, and it was just amazing. Super delicious on noodle dishes. I, be, I believe it would be good on chicken, any type of stir fry, fried rice, uh, anything like that. I think it would just be amazing. I think this would be amazing on my wife Myung's. Um, pork or beef mandu dumplings that she makes and even on egg rolls as a dipping sauce I believe it would be good I heat on this one I think it's uh, about a low three a two to three category it's net so uh, labeled at medium heat but I, I think I would just give it a solid three yeah about a three out of ten for heat but super super delicious great job on this one Clark guys check this out I highly recommend it you can find it at magohotsauce.com Link will be down in the description. Clark, thank you so much for sending this one. I do appreciate it. And guys, thanks so much for watching. Please, if you haven't already, just uh, subscribe to my channel. All you got to do is click that Enjoy the Burn logo right there. And then uh, hit that notification bell so you don't miss a thing. And until next time, make sure you enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.